Sandra, Russia is accelerating its aerial attacks on Kiev as the troop advance remains stalled on the outskirts of the city. Kiev Mayor Vitaly Klitschko recording this video earlier today to highlight Russia's attacks on the innocent. Watch. That's what the Russians' war against the civilians looked like. Destroyed buildings, destroyed infrastructure. City bus just got hit by the rocket. Lives are getting lost. Putin's war against Ukraine. That's what it looks like. Mayor Vitaly Klitschko joins us now from an undisclosed location. And Mr. Mayor, I know it's extremely busy times and difficult times for you. Thank you for taking the time today. I, I wanted to ask you about going out on the streets today after that missile attack in Kiev that we saw wounded a number of people, ruined part of an apartment building, blew up a city bus. What message did you want to send by going out in the streets today? <clears throat> It's not secret the target of aggressors, target of Russians, is capital of Ukraine, Kyiv. They try to make a panic by uh, citizens. But instead panic, right now the people have huge patriotic wave. Everyone in the building. Today um, I was uh, in the, the apartment building. I talked to the people, we're ready to evacuate you to a uh, safety place in Ukraine, to west of Ukraine. Mm -hmm. People don't want to leave. The old man, over uh, 60, told me, I don't want to leave, it's my hometown. Give me weapons, please. I want to defend my city. This, this mood, everyone have in our city. Actually, some part of the people, uh, women, children, evacuate to the uh, west of Ukraine, but men stay mm -hmm. in Kyiv, and we are ready to defend our city. The Russians never ever come to our city. We are ready to fight, ready to defend our children, houses. We are ready to defend our country and defend our future. Yeah. Mr. Mayor, I'll tell you, the bravery of the Ukrainian people is inspiring to people around the world. And, and the fierceness with which the Ukrainian resistance is fighting is an inspiration to militaries around the world as well, given the face of the odds that are at, it, in front of them. I've, I've been watching some videos this morning of Ukrainian forces out in the field destroying Russian armor, Russian tanks, uh, and they're just on foot doing this all by themselves. But as the Russian forces get closer and closer to Kiev, the artillery shells, the rockets are falling in, a, in an increased pace. What do you expect there in the capital in the days ahead? Uh, <clears throat> they, it's no secret. It's uh, just Russians have plans in two days, three days, four days maximum to make a circle and come into the Kyiv. Right now, already three weeks done, three weeks of war. The, and, uh, and Ukrainian soldiers destroyed the plans of aggressors. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and uh, that's why it's, I told thank you very much for our forces, for our soldiers, and they very tough and uh, stay front uh, to face of one of the strongest army in, uh, in the world. But huge patriotic way, wave, huge will to win. It's our land, it's our city, and we're ready to fight. But by the way, thank you very much for the uh, United States to support. We need modern weapons. We, uh, the, our government told, uh, told about close the sky. Mm -hmm. If you have the pat uh, Patriot, if you have the uh, uh, records, we close the sky above our, our head by cell. Yeah. Uh, Mayor, Mayor Klitschko, I wanted to ask you about what's going on there in the south of the city, where in, in two cities, Melitopol and Dnipro-Rudny, uh, Russian forces have kidnapped the mayors of those two cities and installed puppet uh, mayors to run the city. What, what do you say to Putin about what he is doing down there with the kidnapping of these mayors? <clears throat> the mayor is a represent, a representative of community. Mayor is civilian. They kidnapped mayor of uh, Melitopol. They killed the mayor of Gastomel a couple of days ago. It's uh, uh, actually the war have also rules. Never touch children. Never mm -hmm. touch uh, women. Never touch civilian. 
but Russians doesn't follow the rules, and uh, what they, the mayor is symbol, symbol of the, of the city, symbol of community. Yeah. They can yeah. block the mood of the people, and that's why they kidnap kidnap the mayor and uh, it's actually against whole rules and uh, we see how unfriendly how is uh, they unhuman yes activity make russians in our land mayor, mayor, mayor klitschko i i assume that the russian plan to replace mayors would apply across uh, the entire country, and that would include Kiev as well. What are you going to do if the Russians try to kidnap you? I am ready to fight. It will be not easy to do that. I, uh, every citizen, every is nobody, nobody safe, uh, nobody feels safety in our country right now in this very uh, difficult uh, situation. But everyone ready to fight ready to defend our city. And uh, I'm not worried about kidnapped. That's why mm -hmm. I'm ready to fight. That's why I have weapons. That's why it's my hometown, and I want to defend the interest of my citizens, interest of my home, interest of my family. Well, we should point out as well that you are a heavyweight boxing champion, so if anybody's coming for you, they better bring a lot of guys. Um, I, I heard a, one military analyst on Fox News this morning saying that if Ukraine can hang on for 10 more days, Russia may not be able to continue to pursue the fight given the losses that it is incurring. Can you hang on? Uh, <clears throat> the Russian uh, soldier uh, actually right now uh, have uh, bad mood and uh, so, many, so many people understand the senseless war. They see how every citizen, every civilian against this war, and everyone told exactly the same message. Go away, Russians, go away from our country. Mm -hmm. Every gr grandma, uh, every woman, every child, everyone told exactly the same. They feel very uncomfortable in this war. It's every soldier because yeah. the Russian population, the Russian population, re are really zombed from Russian propaganda. They talk about nationalists, fascists, extremists um, who live in Ukraine. They come in here and see it's liar. Hmm. The good people live there, and nobody expect their. Uh, a Russian intervention, first point, and everyone which just won peace yeah. in our country, and Russians go away home, go away from out, go out from from Ukraine. Mayor Vitaly Klitschko, we thank you for spending time with us today. Our best to you, sir.